welcome back, you beauties. Time to get into our performer's arc this morning because it's an incredible trajectory that he is on. Bravo LaRue is an award-winning rapper. He's proven his credentials. And following the unbelievable success of his debut album, Igazi, Linyambezi, Nombilo, Blood, Sweat and Tears, he recently released the highly anticipated deluxe of that offering. Let's take just a little listen to one of those gems. Bravo's going to be performing for us, so we thought let's just take a moment to catch up with the man. First of all, let's give him a feel good. Welcome to the show, Bravo LaRue, back in the house. <clears throat> I know we're not thousands of adoring fans that you become used to, my brother. Um, can I say the best run of your life? Can I say that you are on a vein of form that is just next level at the moment? How are you feeling right now in your career, my brother? Ah, oh, man, it's like, yeah, it's been, it's been like a crazy run. I think this is the best run I've ever had like this far with my career. Just like, um, like creating like an album that went like number one, like in 10 hours in South Africa. Like, you know, like independently featuring massive. like it's my massive. favorite artists, traveling the world, you know, like all of that. It's It's been an amazing journey. Um, and I'm really grateful for uh, it. And we're grateful for it as well because you deserve it, dude. You absolutely deserve it. You haven't strayed from, and, and I know it is quite intentional. I know there is a lot going on behind the scenes. People think you just wake up and you just let it roll like this, but you work unbelievably hard yeah. at that notion. Why the deluxe? I, and I'm not complaining by any stretch, <laughs> but, but when something is this good, you want yeah. to kind of let that expand and let it breathe. But what was your motivation? Um, okay, first of all, like albums, like nowadays, like are never like an option. Or where, when artists are dropping albums, they will drop maybe like eight or 10 tracks, you know? So I pushed for, for 15 tracks, like first of all, and they were eaten up, you know? Like songs, like different songs, just like started training. There are no stocking fillers in you there, know? bro. So Everyone like, a banger, yeah. People have been supporting me. It's been an amazing journey. So like, why not we add some, you know, like to the story because it's like a book. So for I feel sure. like there's a chapter that I've been like really um, shared with them, you know? And I see like the next music I'm going to be starting like creating after the deluxe is going to be like different, you know, of just like where so I'm soak I'm this headed. up, yeah. soak this up. When you get a performance, I know you're going to be um, at the Cape Spring Experience this weekend. Yeah. Do you still enjoy the performing mm -hmm. or the recording process? Or is it a bit of both? Where do, do you feel most happy that when this energy is able to come out of you because clearly you're a creative on another level and i would imagine you love the writing but being on a stage on a stage like that has got to be special man <laughs> stage like that nah it's crazy like like i surely love performing you know like I, I love performing more than being like in studio but i have to be in studio in order to perform. exactly you know? chicken and um, egg but yeah. like a great lineup for the first time ever i feel like this like lineup, like for, for Saturday is actually also like a defining moment in my life, you know? Wow. Like I'm bringing my, my mom for the first time. <laughs> like, and yeah. mommy is, like, yeah, please, please yeah, introduce yeah, your mom. <laughs> uh, what is your mom's name? Um, we sis Pingy, but she like, she, we call it Pink Dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Pink Dollar, okay, yeah. that's, that's now yeah. you said it on live TV, it's done forever, man. Yeah, and I brought her here today, um, cause she, she, she doesn't, she has an idea of what I do, but she never seen it, you know? So like, we're on national TV right there now. There we go, there. Say hi to your TV. Nelly. Hello, mama. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, so this I is like that. a defining moment, you know, like for me being here like on national TV, uh, me performing on the same lineup as Uringo that I know is her crush, you know, it's like... Okay. Yeah. You're not alone, Mama. You're not alone. <laughs> okay. I, some of us have lived long enough to have that, have earned that right, my friend. Have earned that right. Uh, buddy, you deserve absolutely everything that's happening to you. If anything, it should have happened just a little bit earlier. But now that it's happening, we are so grateful, dude. Enjoy being on this little stage and enjoy yeah. being on that stage. Um, we'll keep those details up on how you can get tickets. Um, but I think the Cape Spring experience is going to be next level. A yes. defining moment. Yes, sir. And it comes straight from the man himself. It's cost blood, sweat 
sweat and tears to get to this point. Uh, but you'll understand why he is doing so well with some amazing performances coming your way. But right now, we've got to get into the official duties with the news headlines.